Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. Watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you! What the fuck? Disrespectful little asshole! I can't believe you did that! That's my TV! You don't talk to me like that! I can't believe you... Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole! Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah! No! I just... Want you to do something besides sit there eating? Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah. Well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah. Uh, bike ride, then. Bike ride? Y you want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. Uh, fuck me. A bike ride along Vespucci Beach? Uh, okay, Dad. I got just the thing to show you. This day was going so well until you showed up. You know that? Ugh. Yo, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. If I'm hanging with you, I'm listening to my music. Fuck yeah, I'm a jam. How am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuckface? Help me. Push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnaps. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think? 
think I'm gonna let some guys right off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us. You're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway... I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years. But that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Here we are at the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Oh, hello there. How are you doing today? Hey, you! Two bites. Take your pick. Yo, thanks. If I beat you to the end of the pier, you're buying me a new TV! Into the pier? All right. But if I beat you, you're gonna behave like a human being! Ah. Looks like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Fuck.
Take me out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Your house? Yeah. Man, you gotta kill her bad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Those walls can talk. You think I do it? Hey! No! Hey! Shit, hey, Daddy. cool, man. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, oh, hey! Oh, 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 man! I like that! What's the problem? You're such a jerk! Come on! Dad, you dumbass, these guys are serious! Yeah, well, so am I! Go to the seat of my fucking boat! Oh, motherfuckers! Get on! Now! I'm about to skin you alive! God damn it! Go! Shit! They're coming after us! Go into that outlet! If you say so, Trace. Them down here. Who the fuck are these people? Oh, you know, TV people, celebs, serious drug dealers. Well, since when did TV people and drug dealers start hanging out? Come on, Dad, it's Los Santos. Just go, okay, go. How is camping us going to solve anything? Hey, hurt buckets, if you kill us, you'll be jailed, and the sea sharks will be impounded. I can't believe I sort of had sex with you, you psychopath! My dad's the one you want to kill! He's on the front of this thing! Looks like this is the way out! The worst. They're gone? Cool. See, it's okay. I'll take you back to Jim. Okay! No, it's not okay! Not at all! Hey, we're alive, aren't we? Those psychos didn't kill you. Psychos? Only you could get me chased out of a party with effing guns! Yeah, huh? Well, maybe you're in the wrong fucking party! Okay? He smashed my TV and he took me to the beach. The beach with my skin. So what? You sent him out to spoil my day too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes and he just went. I'm getting a cab. Coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life.
Don't touch me! Oh, you don't have to call. That opportunity. I said get off me, you stupid bastard. I told you, she's a biter. That's assault on top of the shoplifting beat. Man, the paperwork. What you packing? Get out of the car! Shit! Whoa. All right, let's go! Let's go! Let's go, Michael! Chill out. It's under control. Get us out of here! Relax, I got this. I know what I'm doing. Don't cut eyes, huh? Need some assistance. Shit! They're still on us! I'm on top of it. Go, 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 go! Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. Come on, come on! Come on! Relax, I got this. Is that it? Are they gone? Of course they're gone. Who are you talking to? Come on, I'll take you back to the house. Don't say it! What? That I have everything I want, so why am I stealing? Oh, my lips are sealed! Because if you say that, I'll say the same to you! I'm not saying anything! I'm just doing my best to keep us out of jail! Are we going home? I mean, who are you to judge me? Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, and yeah, thank you.
I said look nice. Can you put a suit on, please? The sooner you change, the sooner we can find you a score. you come back. the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. The shop's on Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. No FIB. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. 
Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Well, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums to a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white, middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Now take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Have a wonderful day. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation yeah, comes out. Gig. I'll be taking classes at nightlight. <laughs> Drive around the block and look for a way up to the roof. Look, there. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. I'm on the roof. All right, use the glasses to get me a shot of Angelico's roof unit. It'll be right above the store. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. Right, you're well placed to take the photo of the system now. Okay. Capture an image of the system, and we're done. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do.
this up, Michael. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll... Shit! Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. Might be able to wipe every remote thing. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Yeah, good. An alarm system is linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window so when towns it hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store by the register. So I'd start there. Mm. The glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, it means you could smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. We might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. Here are the photo. Uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Uh, well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well. Mapping out the options, you know, showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. Now, there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've gotta find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSP. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay, select personnel with that. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Ah, okay, this one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Ah, Norm. Came across as a, a bit of an idiot, but could be useful. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Let's take a chance on him. That look good to you? Are you sure? Great. Uh, I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you.
playing nothing but the music that's too good to be hits. I'm gonna be using your car. Hey. All right, Lester, we got a pest control van. Good. I've got a line on the knockout gas. It's made in some lab on the coast, but two shipments a day come through the city from the northeast, taking it to the airport. All right. I'll see if I can jump one.
Hey, Lest. I got the good night guess. That's everything we need. I'll put out word that the score is ready to go. Now we all know why we're here. We've got a store to take. The plan is simple, elegant. Listen to Lester, pay attention to the information he gives you and we'll all make a buck. If things go bad, you know the drill. This wasn't organized, we don't know each other. We got caught up in a robbery and acted in self-defense. But it's not gonna be an issue because everything's gonna go just fine. The, um... The uh, alarm system is easy. Now, if I didn't need to be running things, I could have it offline myself. No problem, but uh, you should be able to get us a pretty decent window. How decent depends on the job you do. Now, uh, once it's down, you signal Michael, he makes the call. Things look good. We should be able to drop a present right through the air vent on the roof. Everybody goes to sleep. No problem. We take our time. If we run into trouble, we move quickly and with force. Any questions? No? Let's go. Frank, you're with me. Ricky, I hope you can manage the truck with the bikes. Norman Kareem, you've got the van with Bugstar on the side of it. See you on Little Portolo, people. Initials only from here on out. All right, you got it down? I got it. Because you use too much gas on these guys, you'll kill them. Well, shit, don't blame me the way these canisters is mixed. Just be careful. <laughs> yeah, okay. Listen, I stuck my neck out for you here. Man, you don't need to tell me that shit again. I got faith in you, F. Bullshit. But you're unproven. Unproven? For real. So I didn't prove myself when I jumped off the back of that yacht on the highway, huh? Yeah, but these guys don't know you. They see some gangbanger with a happy trigger finger. They got money and their freedom on the line. I ain't gonna fuck this up, man. Good. I got enough shit to worry about. Hey, uh, so you made savings on the personnel, huh? Yeah, well, yeah, I figure they're on Lester's list of potentials. They can't be that bad. Sure, man. What could go wrong? Cheap hacker, cheap driver, cheap gunman. Ah, uh, pretty much everything could go wrong. We got this, man. Don't worry. Great! Nice the novice is reassuring me. <laughs> oh, brother. All right, when the gas is in the ventilation system, give us the word. For sure, man. I got it. Hello? Exterminators here? Hey, there ain't no one around. That suits us. Come on. Get up to the roof! Get your ass out of here! Almost there! We're in position, waiting on your signal. Just gotta get where I can throw this. That was it. They going out. You love her. Well, I, I love her a lot. I just, I wasn't thinking it was... Well, think about it like this. I mean, I always say that... I told him to fix that goddamn AC! What's going on? Let's go. Let's do this! Come on! Following your lead. Maybe 30 seconds left. 
It don't matter if we lose some, right? Let's go! Let's go! Screw these rich pricks. Ten, um, nine, um, eight, seven, six, uh, uh, five! Coast is clear. If we move now, man, it'll be a clean kill. Don't yep, show for the last time. Move it. Man, get the fuck out of my face. Oh! You forget a thousand things every day, pal. Make sure this is one of them. I'll see you at the river. Go! Let's go! Come on! Map says this way, boys, all right? I'm driving blind back here. Hey, ain't the driver meant to be telling us where to go? No. Oh. Oh. Driver, shit, where we going? Ah. Yeah. It's going out to ah. the I can do with some damn warnings before we turn. G crashed this bike, man. That's what happens when you're working with fools. You've been employed as a driver. I mean, you're supposed to know where you're going. Wait, it was, um... Screw it. We go this way. I hope you're right. If I know about the mud, I might have chose a different bike. Hey, these sports bikes ain't handling the mud. We should have got some scramblers, man. You asked for bikes. I got fast bikes. No one said scramblers. I'm here! Keep driving! Hey, oh, fuck! Fuck! Hang in there, boys! I got bull bars on the truck! I'll make short work of these cops! for a better gunman. What happened to his part of the score? I managed to pick it up. All right then, good work. F, come on, get in. Lester's waiting for us at the lockup. My name's DJ George, and no. Oh, fuck, man. I thought I was gonna be stuck to that bike. Yeah, I thought you were gonna be stuck under a cop car. There gotta be more dudes waiting around that way. We did not just get away with that shit, did we? You know what? I think we did. Ah, oh, man. All right! Woo! You guys gotta join my herd. Holla! I think I found my new calling, bros. In you come. Come on. All right, people. We need to split up. 
They're gonna be looking for a crew. Don't you get it? That ain't what I was looking for. Not then, not... Hey, there you are. What's cracking? So, we all good? Hell yeah, we all good. We did. Yeah, you fucking ain't right, we did. So, here's the shot. Lester's offloading the gems. He knows a guy. Get us 50 cents on the dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, we might actually have a little spending money left after we pay off that psychotic Mexican motherfucker. Whew. Cheers. So that's that, right? I hope so. The whole job. Everything about it. Anyone who knows your file, what is wrong with you? Davey! Long time no see. And what about Trevor? If that fruitcake realizes, no, no, finds out you're alive, you are D-O-N-E fucked! Hey, don't worry about Trevor. Trevor's dead. It's gotta be. Besides, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Whatever the hell it is you're talking about. Nothing. Really? Criminals are believed to escape with millions of dollars worth of gems, oh. precious stones, and hey, hey, hey. rings. Albert's story had a lucky escape when the thieves ran straight into it. Yeah, I was just doing my job, and I say to this guy, hey, you gotta move these bikes. I don't know anything about that. And this other guy runs out of the shop, he pushes me over and says something like, you forget thousands of things every day. You make sure this is one of them. That was pretty scary. Back to you in the studio. You want to get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you want to you want to smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it, Trevor. You been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole. Don't do it, Johnny. I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high. We all get high. But that don't Leave make it, it right. Johnny. Leave it. The crystal has got us, babe, but don't make it right. Don't make nothing right. Not what you done with me. I'm telling Johnny, leave it. I ain't leaving nothing. Trevor! I'm talking to you, motherfucker! Are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Well, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? I is that the problem here? Take off your pants, cowboy. All right, let's, let's fuck. 
You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him. Leave it. Leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to fuck me a meth head, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums, huh? Fuck you, Trevor. Oh. I still love her. All right, cowboy. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. I don't mean nothing by it, man. I just... I know. I messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay, man. Give me a hug, yeah. Fucking shit! Cut! 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 Who the fuck are you speaking to? Who? Who? I'm talking to you, huh? You fuck! Johnny! Huh? Next time, don't get in my fucking face! I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you then! Johnny! Wait! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! The wheels are in motion. We gotta reach out to the rest of them. Careful, Trevor! Okay! Wait! This ghost I saw, his name is Michael Townley. Sounds like he's living in Los Santos. Find him. Really? Uh, my cousin's there, but I don't... Find him! Wait, does this mean I don't have to come see the bikers? We're in a hurry, but not that much of a hurry. But if we bury Johnny in the desert, and then quiet down that bitch Ashley he was in, then they don't need to find out about it. You think it's clever to disrespect women? Disrespect? What? I, I wasn't disrespecting. I was just saying we should kill her. You called her a bitch. Ain't you got a mother? Everyone got mothers, at least one. We're going up to that farm on the right? That's where they're meant to be. Gaga! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, you seen Ashley Johnny's looking for? Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did, just 10 minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you messing with her again. Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy, you mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry, what was that? Well, no, 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 you don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient part of you left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy. Bullshit! Oh, I like it, denial. That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Well, looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit. Oh, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies. If that van takes us back to the camp, this area ain't gonna have a biker problem much longer. Do we go 
know where you're going yet? I got a feeling, yeah, but we gotta make sure. Once you know, you can drop me and Wade at the trailer. Maybe bring Chef to finish that. We do this now, Ron, all of us. Where are your boys at? I gotta taste dirt by your blood! Where we go? Come on! The van won't get there if we shoot it too much. Maybe you should hold off shooting the van. Oh, look, look! They're pulling up! You did it, Trevor! They're stopping! Hold the perimeter, fuckwits. Daddy's going to work. One son of a bitch! I'm gonna take a ghost in Los Santos, all right? You looking for motivation? And get me some sticky bombs! We're dropping in on Ortega. He has Tekas? That makes me nervous. Ah, don't be nervous, nervous, Ron. He'll be fine with the takeover. Takeover? Trevor! We don't need to. Now the bikers are gone. It's just us, the Aztecas, and the O'Neills. The market's big enough. This Chinese contact's gonna buy crystal fast as we can cook it. There he is. Let's wake him up. What? With the truck? No, come on. No, no. The tank is in the county. Soggy friend, you are out of business. The lost MC are out of business. The guns and crank in this area go through Trevor Phillips Enterprise, or they ain't going. 
Saying something don't make it true. Trevor! You're out of business, my friend. The Aztecas is an international enterprise. I think he gets it. We was always cool. I don't like the way he's looking at me. I'll go away, man. But my people... I think he gets the message. Let's go. Come on, T. Let's go. I don't know what these naysayers are talking about. Look at me. I'm cranked on speed most of the time, but I'm productivity personified. You sure achieved a lot today. It was time to put my affairs in order. Oh! Put my affairs in order. You going somewhere? As soon as I find that Spectre on the TV, Michael Townley. He's your buddy you said got shot, right? You guys used to run together. Yeah, that's him. My best pal. I thought he was dead. You're catching on fast. Yeah, the fucking ghost I've been talking about. He's alive? He's walking, and he's talking. He's sticking up joints, so I guess, yeah, that makes him alive, don't it? And how do you know it's him? It's his M.O., and it's the same corny shit he was spewing ten years back. This could be a trap, Trevor. What if someone wants you to think he's alive? I was fooled when I thought he was dead. I ain't fooled now. Michael Townley lives and breathes. He's in Los Santos, and he's got some explaining to do. They could be trying to draw you out into the open. Get out of the car, Ron. Any time to think. 